Um, hi, I'm Manesto. You know, yeah, this is not my normal uh, YouTube content, but this is to help anyone out there who needs to learn a guitar tutorial for <laughs> for Island Fires and Family. Um, which is one of my favorite songs by Dermot Kennedy. Honestly, I love Dermot Kennedy. So yeah. So um, it's in standard tuning. You have to have a capo on third fret. If you want third fret, uh, cables aren't that much, they're like six bucks. I mean, these kind of cables are like 20 bucks. But you know, it, it's worth the money because then you're gonna use it a lot. Like, I have three capos. But, you know. uh, so, uh, so we're gonna start out on the B string of the, uh, of the third fret. Um, so we're gonna say, like, this is on the neck of the guitar we're gonna say that the capo is um... so this will be the first fret from the capo second fret, third fret, not um... cause technically this would be fifth fret but uh... this would be fifth fret and this would be sixth fret but we're not doing that so we're gonna have um... A B string of the third fret you hold that down and then just let go and then you pluck So you pluck uh, your low E, your B, and I think your G, yeah, and your G, and then it's, alright, so you just go, from there we have, uh, we press, we do the same plucking pattern, so the plucking pattern is, so if you want to see my hand, okay, so it's, so you pluck uh, B, B, G, and uh, your low E, and then you go Just all three of them at once. And then you don't pluck the top one on the next two ones, but then you go and you pluck, pluck the bottom two, but you still have your finger on this one. So it's um, your finger, finger will always be on this one. So so when it, when it goes like, yeah, it, it's still going to be on this one. So it's like, so you go. So again, it's uh, then boom. So after the um, it goes, you press your finger of, on the third fret of the um, low E string, and then your um, and then you pluck the same things into the same um, kind of. Chord progression because y you go like this, so it's like. How am I feel to be a bird? And then so, see, it's the same progression but over and over again, but with like your finger in different places, you know. So it, you, you just have to master the uh, you plucking the low E string, the G string, and the I uh, the B string, yeah. So then, then you go to your A string, third fret of A, A string. Sorry, my guitar is kind of out of tune, but um, uh, third fret of A string, and then you, and then you pluck the same one, and then right here, um, you go on, on the first one, on the first one when you start singing, you have to do this really cool thing, which is. Now it's uh, and so um, that you're keeping your finger right here, but you have to do you have to hammer on. So uh, so you do this, just pluck this, but you but you but you hammer on, and then you hammer off. So you pluck it twice basically. So you're like or. If you have like a hard hit on it, it goes. But if you um, want to do it like more softly, you go. Then you pluck it normally after you lift it off. You don't technically have to do a hammer on, then a hammer off of it. But if you want to. And then with that, you go. And then. So that's. Um, 
the second fret of the G string. And it's the same thing with the B, but instead of it's on the G string of the second fret. So, so. So the first fret will go. How am I still feel feel to be a bird? And then you go. But you have to practice that. So it's, it's it, 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 it took me a while to get it, but it's so um you probably wanna what I do is uh. What I do is pluck um, the B string with my middle finger and do um, do the B string with that one and then and then with your with my thumb I go on the um, G string with the second fret you go so you know and then, and then on the, so it's like how my And then it's like Rome and only your heart the sea air. So you basically do um so um for the last one you do it twice. So it's like the first one when you're singing the chorus first, you do but then after that you do um you instead of that on the second one where it's like uh Uh, where it's like Rome and lowly oh the sea you go So it goes um just the normal ba 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 no you can ba 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 Yeah it's just normal but then you do it again then you do it one more time. Rome, lonely, oh, the sea, air. But you can do basically whatever you want. It sounds good, but you, you, you have to do two, two of these, which is... Because you can do how much of whatever, like plucking to the B and um, G string as you want, but um, just do two of these, like with the A string on first finger up, A string on the third fret. So then we're gonna do this, uh, and then after that, um, we're on to the chorus, which from the um, wait no no no. Okay. So then we're going to um, alternate, and we're just gonna be playing. Um, no, we're gonna be playing. After that, you know the part. If if you want to learn the song, you know the, the song. So um, and you just you basically play what I taught you on the second. It, it so. Oh yeah, again on the third uh, line of the first chorus, it's again the. As you can hear in the song, but then on the fourth line, it's just. You have this part where you're just like, oh, 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 yeah. and through that whole entire thing, um, you don't, um, what am I saying? Uh, you don't, uh, y you don't play. You don't do through that whole entire um, for from the fourth line of the. Second, uh, first verse, you don't um, play um, at all through that. So with this, so we're gonna take through the chorus. So 
So um, the course is just basically, you, you, you remember, still have that finger on the um, B string of the third fret, and then you have your um, you have your pointer finger um, on the uh, A string of the of the second fret. So you you basically do the same pattern, but instead of plucking low E, uh, you pluck the A like you did in like the third part, which is like this. But but instead it's like this. So you go like this. Which is the first finger? Remember, uh, pointer finger on the second fret of the uh, B, A, the A string. Um, so then you go pluck those, and then you go back to you know um, where you did in the verse, but like the last one in the verse, you have to pluck it. So you go like this. So all together, that's, and then you go down here. You go down here. To your um, I think D string yeah your D string and you, you remember keep your f finger on the uh, B of the third fret just remember um, then on the D string of the second fret you D string on the second fret and then you go no. so you move from the second fret on the, still on the D string to the third fret, and that's the chorus. So it's like, so it's like, and I, oh, I can tell you and I that I'm sorry, no. That you can tell me in life that you love me here. Like that. So, Cause she's bringing the moon and stars to me Down permanent reverie And what I like to do in the uh, chorus, but you, you don't have to do this Is No, I go Like the, cause I I feel like it helps smoothen out. But you can just go if you want to. And then what basically else what we're covering is the uh, um we're covering uh uh the second verse, which is basically so you um you know the part, but it's. So it's basically like the first verse, but without the, you know, without on um, the. So the second verse is different. It's just. Yeah, it's just that. And then when you get to a part where it's like. Because um, when you go to like, I used sh sh to dream that she would talk to me. Then you go to the um, basically what the first verse taught you. But on the first one of when you're saying that, you go, and that'll be the last time of you doing that through throughout the whole entire song. So you go through the whole entire second verse until you get to the end where it's like, I used to dream she would talk to me. I, 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 you should dream that you would talk to me. And then you, from there, um, yeah, you do the same thing like you did. So imagine it's like a mini first verse, you know? So then um, we have, then after that you go straight into the chorus, which is, I, I couldn't tell you enough. That I'm sorry, no. Yeah, you know. And then after that, it goes. Um, you basically do the chorus again. No, uh, the chorus strumming pattern, picking pattern. I mean, which is a picking pattern. Um, but you do. 
yeah, basically what the chorus is. But when he says, um, when Dermot says, uh, you know that feeling when you think your heart is gonna come right out through your shirt. Get it a couple times a year, but now I'm getting it more often with her. Oh. When I'm face to face with death, I grab his throat and ask him how does it hurt? Oh. You know. And then after that, it goes. She's bringing the moon, stars to me, damn permanent robbery. Like, yeah, and then you continue the song. So that's basically it for the song, I mean. Yeah. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. Ooh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I don't usually do guitar tutorials, so you're lucky. You caught me. Thank you for watching, I mean. If you have watched, but, um, uh, I really like that song, so, like and subscribe, please. And this is Manesto.